my sister's room. She's, uh, she's downstairs right now. This whole thing is just really effed up, man. The whole thing is just... My parents are in the Hammer One. That is obvious. Everybody can tell. But what they don't know is they don't know anything about the Order, and they don't know anything about the ceremony. They think they're in some kind of peace, love, religion. Which, they're not. And even worse, they, uh... They don't remember me. Still. And they don't... In fact... <clears throat> They don't remember anything before the accident. It's like someone went in their heads and pushed the reset button. <laughs> She's... I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You know, that's, when I first got here, I really thought that I could have a normal life with them. Baseball games, and barbecues. You know, be a big brother to Emma. Emma. That's a scary thought. I mean, I can't leave her. I just can't leave her here. She's my sister, right? <laughs> one of these days, one of these days, she's going to find out what a bunch of grade-A nut jobs her parents are mixed up with. Just like Breed and, you know, I'm not going to let that happen. There's no way. No, Daniel, I'm not going to kidnap her. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. There's just, there's got to be... There's got to be an answer here somewhere. There's got to be something. I just can't see it. I don't know what it is. Maybe. Maybe I need to just get away and think. So I'm thinking, Daniel, I'm going to take you up on that offer. You know, come crash at your place. Yeah.